All right, y'all. Peace and blessings. God bless you all. I'm Jarvis Kingston, and I hope that y'all doing all right and staying strong and solid in these times that we're in. I pray that you have repented and that you were baptized. I pray that you are safe, protected, and prayed up. And I just pray that whatever situation that you're going through, that the Lord is with you, that he guides you, protects you, he looks out for you, he comforts you. I pray that your mental health gets better and that you become more stronger, wise in the Lord. I pray that you keep fighting a good fight of faith. You keep running your race. You keep your eyes fixed on the Messiah. You keep your eyes fixed on the prize. You stay on a narrow straight gate path. You help out plenty of people along your journey forevermore. Amen. Always remember that the Lord will never leave you nor forsake you and that the Messiah intercedes for you. The spirit intercedes for you as well. So always stay thankful, grateful, appreciative and take it one day at a time. Most definitely. Let us thank the Lord for another day. Let us thank the Lord for waking us up and giving us another day to seek his face. Let us thank the Lord for food in our belly, clothes on our back, and a roof over our head. Let us thank the Lord for protecting us coming in and going out, guiding us through the morning, getting us through the afternoon, getting us through the evenings, getting us through the nights. He is constantly looking out for us with his grace, mercy, favor, love, the outstretched arm of God, the mighty hand of God, the finger of God, his word, his only begotten son who died for our sins. There's plenty of things the most high God has done for us throughout our lifetime. It continues to keep doing for us because his mercy is everlasting and his truth endures forever. Amen. So always keep him first. Always worship him, praise him, thank him, call on him, sing a song to him, clap your hands. Always trust him. Always hearken to his voice, hearken to his word. Just keep him first, people forever. Hallelujah. Amen. Most definitely. Welcome, everyone. I appreciate all of you for listening and supporting. It means a lot to me. I love you all. Praying for you all. Let us always uplift each other in Christ and encourage each other in the Lord. Let us always pray for each other, intercede for one another, comfort each other, support each other. All those great, awesome, amazing things, people. Brothers and sisters of the faith all over the world, let's be together on one accord for the Lord. Amen. Much love to the 12 tribes of Israel scattered all four corners of the earth. All the scattered Israelites among the nations, all ends of the earth. Much love to the churches the mysteries out there with the sound doctrine, the peace, the love, the harmony, the fellowship, and the services. Much love to all the previous martyrs, the current martyrs, and the future martyrs, the brave, bold, isolated, courageous believers who are going through it for the gospel, who are being persecuted for the faith, who are going through many tribulations and hardships for his namesake. Stay strong, patient, steadfast, firm, and encouraged. Your brothers and sisters of the faith are with you, and the Messiah is with us always forever till the end of the age. Amen. Much love to the great tribulation saints down the road. Much love to all the grafted in Gentiles of all nations, tribes, languages, tongues, races, faces, kindreds all over the world. Much love to all the brand new converts out there, all the brand new creatures in Christ out there, all the born again people, the Holy Spirit filled people. God bless all the believers, all walks of life. Amen. Most definitely. Anyone who just repented, God bless you. Anyone who just got baptized, God bless you as well. Anybody who's having dreams, encounters, visions, testimonies, God bless you also. If you did not repent and get baptized, go repent and get baptized ASAP immediately. Shalom, family, greetings to all of you. Welcome, everyone, all peoples, all nations, all tribes, all languages, all tongues, all races, all faces, all kindreds, everybody. Let everything that has breath praise the Lord. All the animals, all the creatures, all the beasts, all the fishes in the sea, the birds in the air, the trees, the plants, the mountains, the insects. Let all of God's creation praise him. Amen. Whether you are an Israelite or a Gentile, it is all right. Whether you are chosen or adopted, grafted in, it is all right. Let us gather together and praise the most high. Sing a new song. Clap our hands. Stomp our feet. Praise him. Rejoice. Always rejoice. Make a joyful noise. Make a joyful sound. Crowd to him. Dance. Express yourself. Play an instrument. Do what you have to do for the most high God. He is always watching us. So always serve him with gladness and joy and always worship his spirit of truth. Amen. Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God is one Lord. Love the Lord your God for all your mind, heart, soul, strength, and might. Love your neighbor as you love yourself. Let's keep doing Father's business and Father's will for the rest of our lives until the sun comes back. Amen. He is coming back like a thief in the night in a twinkling of an eye. He is coming back at an hour nobody knows but the Father. Let us be alert, sober, vigilant, watchful, prayed up, washed by the water, by the word, the washing of the water through the word. Let us keep our lamp in oil. Let us stay on our purpose and call for the most high God. Let us know the Lord better. Let's get more close to him. Let's seek his face. Draw near to God. He'll draw near to you. Let's obey the gospel. Let's obey the law, statutes, and commandments. Let's obey all of God's word. Anything the Most High has told us personally, according to our life, our calling, our purpose, our situation, our gifts, our talents, our circumstances, handle it, people. Keep it all together for the Most High God. Keep the faith. Keep the word of God. Keep the testimony of the Messiah. Keep the law, statutes, commandments, decrees, precepts, ordinances, covenants, judgments, charges, observances. Get a five-subject notebook. Get a pack of 24 pens. Get a Bible and write a copy of the whole Torah from Genesis all the way through Deuteronomy by the job, by the tittle, by the line, by the precept, embrace that new covenant and stay faithful and obedient to the most high and stay upright. Okay, people move forward and press forward. Okay. So today's message, what I love to do is go through today's day of devotional. And then from there, I will close out with the prayer. I will close out with the priestly blessing and I will close out giving all the praise, honor and glory to the most high God of Abraham, Isaac and Jacob and praise his only begotten son who died for our sins. Amen. Hallelujah. So here we go. All right.
in the prayer is based in Psalm 31, verse 14. It starts off with the quote, We have thought of thy loving kindness, O God, in the midst of the, thy temple. Psalm 48, verse 9. Amen. Devotion based on Psalm 48. The whole earth is his, and it blesses him. As you transition from the day into the evening, may you gain inspiration from the way the earth turns to God in worship, love, and praise. Clear your mind and release your fears, worries, and doubts to God. Lie still and imagine a beautiful city filled with the glory of the Lord, fortified with his strength. Like this beautiful city, the Lord is within you, protected and sustaining you. He is your fortress. Ask him to inscribe his word on your heart so that you can carry his truth and love with you into the night. You can rest knowing he is watching over you throughout the day and throughout the night. Acts reflection, ad adoration, rest in his presence knowing you are safe and secure in him. Rejoice in his righteousness. Know his word will never die and his love will never fail. Thank him for who he is. Confession. Think of a time when your complaints and doubt toward God outnumbered your praise. Confess this to him now and ask him to continually remind you of who he is and who you are to him, beloved. Thanksgiving. Praise the Lord for his strength and power. Praise him for the times he has protected you and the love he has for you. Supplication. Father, I look to you now and praise you from deep within my heart. Goodness is too great to fathom. Create in me the daily habit of reading your word. May I turn to you for guidance, protection, discernment, and truth. Help me to rest in your perfect peace tonight as I remember and dwell on your faithfulness to me. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. Yes, yes, make sure we are always stay strong in the house of prayer, always forever, people, amen. Most definitely need that revival, hallelujah. Scripture, but I trust in you, the Lord, I said, you are my God. Psalm 31, verse 14, the prayer. Dear Lord, you are my refuge and place of peace. For your namesake, deliver me. Incline your ear and answer me speedily. Lord, I feel like a refugee, wandering and aimless in a land of uncertainty. Be my rock and fortress, Lord God, and let me not be put to shame. I want to run this race well and glorify your name. By your abundant goodness and glorious grace, grant me ears to hear your voice and eyes to see your face. I will wait on you. I will trust you. I will bless you all of my days. Tonight, I ask for peace. Comfort me in your presence and drape me in a blanket of your love. Envelop me with relief and restore me so I may praise you in the morning. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. Hallelujah. Praise the most high God of heaven and earth. Yes, he is the God of Shem, the God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, the God of Jacob. He is the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob forever. He is the God of Israel. He is the God of the Hebrews. He is the God of Jeshurun. He is the God of Noah, Job, and Daniel. Hallelujah. Praise the most high God. He is the Lord of the armies. Praise him. Yes, he's the God of David. Praise the most high God. His only begotten son died for our sins and rose up three days later. Much love to the Messiah for sins, but for all of us. Hallelujah. Praise the Messiah. Praise the Lord always. He's the last Adam, the second Adam. Praise the Lord. He is the advocate. Hallelujah. You praise him, the almighty, true and living God. Praise the Lord, the Alpha and Omega. Amen. The apostle of our profession, the arm of the Lord, the atonement sacrifice for our sins, the author and finisher of our faith, the author and perfecter of our faith, the author of life, the author of salvation, the beginning and the end, the beginning of creation of God, the beloved son, the blessed and only potent, the blessed and only ruler, the blessed and only sovereign, the branch, the bread of God, the bread of life, the bridegroom, the capstone, the captain of salvation, the chief cornerstone, the chief shepherd, Christ, the Christ of God, the consolation of Israel, the cornerstone, the counselor, wonderful counselor, the creator, the day spring, the deliverer, the desire of the nations, the door, the elect of God, Emmanuel, Emmanuel, God is with us, eternal life, everlasting father, faith and true witness, faithful and true, the faithful witness, the first and last, the first begotten, the first born from the dead, first born of all creation, the forerunner, the gate, the glory of the Lord, God, the good shepherd, the great high priest, the great shepherd, the head of the church, the heir of all things, the heir of all things, the high priest, holy and true, the holy one, the hope, the hope of glory. Glory, the horn of salvation, the I am, the I am that I am, the I am who I am, the great I am, the image of God, Jehovah, 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 Jireh, Jehovah, Shalom, Jehovah, Nassai, Jesus of Nazareth, Jesus, the judge of Israel. The judge, king eternal. He is the king of Israel. Amen. He is the king of kings. Hallelujah. He is the king of kings and Lord of lords. Hosanna, Hosanna in the highest praise. Hosanna, the son of David. Blessed be he that comes in the name of the Lord. We have blessed you out of the house of the Lord. King of saints, king of the ages, king of the Jews, the king, the lamb, the lamb of God, the lamb without blemish, the last Adam, the lawgiver, the leader and commander, the life, the lie of the world, the lion of the tribe of Judah, the living one, the living stone, the Lord, the Lord, our righteousness, the Lord is holiness. The Lord is my banner. The Lord is my portion. The Lord is my 
strength, my rock, my refuge, my good fortress, my high tower, my shield, my buckler, my salvation, my redeemer, my helper, our protector, our safety, our defense, our provider forever. Praise him. Yah, Yahweh, Yahuwah, Yahweh, Shai, Yahweh, Be Yahweh, Ahai, Yeshai, Yeshua, Hamashiach, Barakatha, Shalom, Shalom, Yeshua, Elohim, Yehosha, Yehusha, Yehosha, Ahai, Yeshaya, Adonai, Abba. He is the consuming fire. He is the father of heavenly lights. He is the father of the fatherless, the father of widows, the father of mercies. He is the God of heaven and earth. His son sits at the right hand of him. The government rests on his shoulders. He is the great physician, could cure all things, heal all things. He is the carpenter, could fix all things. With God, all things are possible. Nothing is too hard for the Lord. God made everything in six days and rested on the seventh day. He could fix your situation right now in images. We touch and agree, y'all. Call on him, he'll show you great mighty things. Search and seek him with all your heart and you will find him. He is a reward to those who seek him diligently. Know that he exists, believe him, trust him, know he could do for you. Abide in him and abide in his word. Ask the Father what you need in the Son's name and it shall be given to you. Healing, restoration, deliverance, miracles, signs, wonders, help, comfort, double portion, blessings, unexpected good news, unexpected good turnarounds, favor in your life. I speak double portion favor over your life, everything going in the right direction. I speak that over your life forever, most definitely in his Son's name. Yes. Yes, we are in the group with the Father, Son, Holy Spirit, God is one. We know that for the rest of our lives, the outstretched arm of God will be in our lives forever. The mighty hand of God will be in our lives forever. The finger of God will be in our lives forever. Our faith has made us well. Our faith has saved us. Our faith has blessed us. Our faith is how we overcome the world. We walk by faith and not by sight. We're justified by faith in the Messiah that just shall live by faith. Yes. His timing is perfect timing, due timing, on timing, God we serve, amen. Stay steadfast, firm, stay fixed on the people, and stay strong and patient. His timing is perfect. He's refining us, purifying us, and molding us right where he needs us to be, amen. So he got us forever, y'all. Praise him. He is the Lord of all, the Lord of glory, the Lord of lords, the man from heaven, the man of sorrows, the mediator of the new covenant, the mediator, the messenger of the covenant, the Messiah, the mighty God, the mighty one, the morning star, the Nazarene, the offspring of David, the only begotten son of God. Our great God and Savior, our holiness, our husband, our Passover, our protection, our redemption, our righteousness, our sacrifice, the Passover lamb, the power of God, the precious cornerstone, the prince of kings, the prince of life, the prince of peace, the prophet, the redeemer, the resurrection of life, the resurrection, the resurrected, the life giver, the abundant life, the revelation, the revelator, the righteous branch, the righteous one, the radiant one, the perfect example, the rock, the root of David, the rose of Sharon, the ruler of God's creation, the ruler of the kings of the earth, the savior, the seed of woman, the shepherd and bishop of souls, the Shiloh, the son of Abraham, the son of David, the son of God, the son of man, descendant of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Yes, he's the son of the blessed, son of the most high God, the source of eternal salvation for all who obey him, the son of righteousness, the just one, the one mediator, the stone the builders rejected, the true bread, the true God, the true light, the true vine. He is the truth, amen. He is the way, hallelujah. He is the way, truth, and life. Praise him. The wisdom of God, the witness, the wonderful counselor, the word, the word of God, the word of life, the word of Yahuwah, the word of Elohim, the word made flesh, the word of Yahusha, the living word. Praise him. Yes, we know that his word is purified silver, just as David said in Psalms. We know that every word of God is true, pure, and false, as the book of Proverbs says. And we know that his word is a double-edged sword, as the book of Hebrews says. I mean, touch and agree. The Messiah came to give you life and give it more abundantly. He is a sinless high priest. He's the high priest of the order of Melchizedek. He is the way everlasting. He's the everlasting king. Let us repent and get baptized. Let us forgive others so that the Heavenly Father can forgive us. Let us write a copy of the Torah from Genesis all the way through Deuteronomy. Let us be blameless before the Lord our God. Let us circumcise our hearts before the Lord our God. Let's keep crying out to him, keep repenting, turn from our ways, and let us stay on that narrow path forever, people. All right, most definitely. Prayers are for all peoples, all walks of life. Prayers are for all the poor people, all the widows, all the orphans, all the fathers, the tribe of Levi. Prayers are for the strangers, the sojourners, the foreigners. Prayers are for everybody out there, all walks of life. The babies, the children, young boys, young girls, the teenagers, young men, the young women, the adults, the senior citizens. Prayers are for the elders. Okay, prayers are for single people, married people, divorced people, widowed people. Prayers are for single parents, co-parenting. Prayers are for all marriages, all relationships, all households. Prayers are for every environment there is out there, all four corners of the earth. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come. Your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debt doors. And do not lead us into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For yours is the kingdom and the power and the honor and the glory forever. Amen. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord lift up his counsels upon you and give you peace. And they shall put my name on the children of Israel and I will bless them. Shalom. Amen. Selah. Barakatha. I'm Jarvis Kingston. I love you all. Praying for you all. Peace.